In this section, we will cover a complete aftermarket speaker installation. Step 1. What you'll need. First, let's begin with what you will need. Speaker terminal kit. Speaker adapter plates. Next, check to see that you have all the necessary tools on hand. We recommend the Skosh TK12 toolkit. It includes panel removal tool, wire strippers, crimpers, and cutters, a screwdriver with seven interchangeable bits, cable runner tool, wire ties, splice connectors, electrical tape, and a computer safe test light. Feel free to contact the Skosh technical support team at any time during your installation. Step 2. Removing the door panel. Let's disconnect the negative terminal of your battery. This will prevent damage to the vehicle's electronics and ensure a safe install. Next, locate all screws that hold the door panel in place. As a rule of thumb, you can usually find screws located near stress points on the door, like handles and armrests. Now, remove the screws and use a panel removal tool to unsnap the door panel. Remove additional trim panels so the door panel can be removed. The mirror cover, door locks, door handle cover, and window cranks can also hold the panel in place. When pulling the door panel off, you should start toward the bottom of the door, since door panels are hung from the top of the panel. Once the panel is free, carefully lift the door panel off the door and disconnect all power window and door lock wires. For assistance, call Skosh Technical Support. We'll gladly answer your questions. Step 3. Mounting the speaker. Now that the panel is removed, unbolt the factory speaker. Disconnect the wire harness from the factory speaker. Remove the factory connector by cutting the wires so you can attach your new speakers. Strip about one half inch from each wire and splice connect them to your new speaker wires. Consult your manual or call technical support for assistance in determining which wire is positive and negative. Strip the new piece of wire and attach speaker terminals to it. Bolting directly into a factory location may require Skosh speaker adapters. Bolt in the new adapter so you can simply screw in the new speaker. Connect the new wires to your aftermarket speaker terminals. Now secure your speaker in place with screws. Take care not to slip and puncture the speaker or surround. For assistance, call Skosh Technical Support. We'll gladly answer your questions. Reinstall your door panel, secure all wiring connections, then reinstall all screws and trim panels. Lastly, reconnect the negative battery terminal so we can test the system. Now you are ready to enjoy your new speakers.